I love the words of this song. That was, that was me. I turned it off so that way you wouldn't hear me drink. I was hoping it wouldn't make that much of a... Apparently, later. If I do that again, I'll try to do it with uh, the fun. Hopefully it won't make any noise. If any of you guys watch the other games, um, Beyond Two Souls or Heavy Rain, yeah, dude. There's, I mean, there was like 30 something endings in Heavy Rain. Of the I was hoping they would have it. Took this. place on Mount Washington. Annie Klein was in charge of the investigation. Thanks for having me, Marty. This is an update on Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. One year ago tonight, the Washington girls left the safety of their parents' lodge and headed out into a snowstorm. Foul play. Not officially, no. There is one individual we're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. More than you know, Marty. Thank you for joining us, Andy. With all the Washingtons tonight, their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. Try it again. But still post it. Like, all right. Don't edit that out. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I am super excited to welcome all my pals back to the annual Blackwood Winter Getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this. And um, that, that's a movie thing. In movies, I know it you generally mean don't see so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Hey, Rune, how's it going? Yes! <laughs> Not saying you don't see them blink at all, but they purposely cut movies so that way you don't see people blinking most of the time. Also, I wanted to be clear, is there 250 something endings? or 250 different stories. I'm doing pretty good. I'm just happy to have my stream up and not dropping frames. Have you gotten around to playing this yet, Rune? No, this is my first playthrough. Um, technically, I played this chapter, though. Um, I had to start over because yesterday I was having such horrible streaming luck. Machete. Sir? 
I hope I love it too. Diligent Sam, Anna's best friend. Considerate, adventurous. Hello? Someone Any there? Screen or... Yeah, I renamed it. Everybody else sees that it's uh until dawn, right? Also, if you could tell me what voice I was mimicking when I was reading the the uh, character stats, get a cookie. <laughs> Maybe even a free game. I got a bunch. Of Okay, that's good. Oh, what? Busted, climb over. Chris. Can't give him a cake. But if you guess it, maybe I'll give you everybody else. Uh. Oof. Gotta pay attention. Fine. Don't need a free game? Or can you still join in the fun and try to guess the voice out? It's from a movie. Anybody else dropping uh, stream, cutting in and out? Thing. Hey, hey, hey. Get out of here. It's okay. That's it. Come on. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. They're it's seriously okay. going to make me do it? That's it. Come on. All right, fine. Hey, school. <laughs> there. Cutie. <laughs> well, I, I fed it to him. He has it now. You all right? I know it's weird. I think it's because they're trying to teach you the mechanic of the game. That's why they make you do it. Yeah, exactly. It's a tutorial. <laughs> cool. Indigenous people. Butterfly prophecy. Black is death. Red is danger. Uh, brown is loss. Yellow is guidance. White is force. You always want to see. Red and black, not so much. Brown means we're going to lose. Right there. Yellow? Looks yellow, right? Game of totem. Butterfly. Thought the color's right there. Yeah, it's yellow. So yellow means guidance. Oh, okay. Also I didn't. I forgot to off. Um, yeah, so when you get gather totems, they go in the bottom of these totems and awesome look. And uh, apparently, once you get them all, it's gonna play some video. Since I only got two, I'm driven, man. that's all we get. Yeah, is anybody else experiencing voice cutting in on that? Nice. 
past this dog. Wow, graffiti all the way up here. Chris, you here? You hear it cutting out a little? I'll try to bend it more. Um, I don't know if it's the microphone or anything, but I'm not dropping frames. Digital microphone. Shouldn't be the case. Oh, it might be, um, what it's called. Oh, did you see that? If you stand still for a while, they just start zooming in on things. Try that again. Didn't do it that time. Max okay. here. Where are you? You're not in the bag, are you? Hello. What do we? Yeah, do? that's what I was saying. It's probably the gateway. So if I go too low, it probably starts cutting off the words. Let's uh close the bag. Maybe these her, her things that she was more of a. We'll do it then. Chris, I'm gonna Sam, do it based on their personalities. Best I can. Methodical. Chris has a crush on Ashley. Protective. Humorous. Oh, so I found something kinda amazing. Yeah. What? I'm not gonna tell you. You gotta see for yourself. Come on, it's this way. Where? Right around here. I'm gonna blow your mind. <laughs> That's exactly what you don't want. I, I hope. Oh, Clue found. Yes. Wanted post. Nice. So his name Victor Milgram. Male. Just like someone thought so. Oh, come on. This place is abandoned most of the year. Wanted to with first degree arson. Oh, hey. The guy that we were running from. The end to fire. Makes a lot of sense. Ta-da! Pretty rad, right? Yeah. That's Come on, look at these beauties. Uh, beauties is not the word that comes to mind. Why is this even here? What do you mean? W what the hell is a shooting range doing at the base of a ski lodge? Uh, dude, have you ever met Josh's dad? Yeah. He thinks he's like Grizzly Adams or something. Wanna try? Uh, no, you go ahead, Grizzly. All right, here goes. Well, the first time I played this, it took me forever to figure out where the target was. Like I kept trying to shoot at this can over here because I thought I could just shoot at whatever I want. No idea there was this timer and everything going on. I had to give you forever to shoot at these. Wow, nice shooting tits. All right, I'm bad. I'm a badass. I'm gonna go ahead and guess it was a wild case of beginner's luck. No, nah, I don't think so, girl. Well, anybody and their brother could shoot a bottle that big, that close. Much as I want to, not that cruel. Not shooting. <laughs> nice shot. Your ass just got sacked. <sighs> Bad pun. Hey, sharpshooter, a ride's coming. Wait, I'm just getting the hang of this. Come on, Chris, the cable car. Gotta remember. Gun at the Man, it is. It's definitely weird coming back up here after a whole year. I swear, the moment I got here, it just all came flooding back. 
Here goes fast. Hey, that's weird. Door's locked. Yeah. Uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. I think it makes sense. Oh, Old stuff happening. I mean, it's a lodge. I was stuck out on this. We've been here. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter how Hotel. rich you are. So and a terrace. Family bought a mountain. Healthy body and mind. That is a bathtub. Nice switch. I thought the car was closer. Can't. Guess we got. Oh. Oops, sorry. Yeah. And... Wait. I'm starting to get the appeal of killing time at the shooting range. How long is this gonna take? It's a big mountain. Yeah. It's so beautiful in the day, but it might just. It's all just based on me, or there are. Oh no, it's really. You're a public. You're pretty tall. Sleeping giant. Can't even hear you what you're saying because the cart is so loud. Finally, you coming? Yeah, well, I was gonna stay here and catch some seas, but okay. Come on, man. Get in. I'm just like going to the prom. Oh, I hope this was the right thing to do. What? You know, getting everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I don't know, I've kind of been worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks. Bro, good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. Ah, uh, you know what? You're right. You know how Josh and I met? No. Okay. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room. I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So, I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low-cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. Confident Jess. Mike's new girlfriend. Trusting you, Robert. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. I don't even know why you're... <gasps> what the hell? Jess, hey! Jessica, over here! Uh, <laughs> are you guys having a really That's... weird stroke? We're stuck in this stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? What do you think she's here for? I wonder if they say anything. I don't. Maybe it's because I pressed the button. I should have sat there for a moment to see if they said something. Oh my god. 
I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there, and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. Look, I got a lot of meat on my bones. This is all muscle down here. Yeah, right. Uh-huh. What's creepy? Hey. <laughs> well, 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 what do we have Chris. here? My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. <laughs> Mike and M split. Were that doesn't together. change much oh, either. Drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Oh. It was basically like a sentence changed from the last decision I made. All right, all right. Let's just get up to the lodge already. It's getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here <laughs> for a bit. look weird. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh huh. Sam. <gasps> Did you see this view? I mean, I don't even get. That whole conversation. To, to just stop and take it all in. Hey, she's she's got this note for Seriously, Mike, but it they sounds like they've already been dating. Right where the cable car ends. Intelligent Emily, Mike's ex, resourceful, persuasive. I don't think it would have been like as pretty. Motivated Matt, Emily's new boyfriend, vicious, active. No. Looks and like a where's woman. the bellboy when you need one? Yeah, I'm hoping so. <sighs> getting chills. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh, yeah. It's going to be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not going to feel like a regular party. I mean... What do you think? Ah! Jesus! <laughs> you say so. Intelligent, driven, persuasive. Mike. M X. <laughs> you guys. Michael. You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on. Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get into the spirit of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. I'm still gonna play him as... Michael, I'm just gonna lay it out. Otherwise, this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward. And we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Matt. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make Still, this weird. Cool. Why does it make that uh, so tone? Good. All good? Creepy You guys going to make out now? Something snapping oh God, in totally. his head. We're so going to make out. Uh, no, seriously. I'm going to go check on the cable car back down the trip. All right. See you, man. See ya. All right. See ya. So there's that build like people's what? Because they status hey, updated. Did you take these the rest of the way. The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important, Matt. Please. All right, I'm gonna try to see if we can persist. I think she's still gonna shoot him away, um, right? I really don't think you should head back down the trail by yourself. Seriously? It's cold out and it's getting dark. You're gonna protect me from it being dark out? I'll just leave your stuff here and come with you. Nobody's gonna steal it. Matt, are you kidding me? You can't leave me alone for five minutes? You really think that little of me? That's not what I meant. Why can't you just listen to me? Wow. Why do you have to question everything oh, I say? I'm sorry, I'm, I'm just trying to be helpful. If you want to be helpful, then you can help get everything up to the lodge as quickly so as you can, okay? So she still you that way. Um, <laughs> okay. Fine. Whatever you want. Thank you. I'll see you up there after I go find Sam. See you in a bit. Damn. I knew she was gonna do it, but 
I had to see what the alternative was. The alternative is him getting shot down even more so, which means this next scene is going to hurt twice as much. For him, anyway. <sighs> Academic. Ashley has a crush on Chris. Inquisitive. Forethought. Or, forethought? Whatever. Out of the corner of my eye, I see that. Sure, but I wonder why she doesn't make a comment. Well, I guess we're really. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. And not in the friend zone kind of way. I might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. <laughs> hey, whoa. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, well, Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real oh scare you. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, wow. <laughs> Man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it, Let me check it out. No. Yep. Take a look. Um, he sure, deserves uh, go to ahead. see. Go ahead. Knock yourself out, I guess. Oh, oh, son of a bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... Damn it. Matt. <laughs> I love how she takes one more peek. Pretty sure it's not gonna make much of a difference, but let's check the book. Ah! Yeah, no. Oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. But who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? Him up. I, well, I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> oh! Great. <laughs> <Great. laughs> hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chicken? <laughs> oh! Ah. This dude gets whooped. Hey! I don't think he hits. Oh, snap. If I can do this right, I don't think he hits. <laughs> Alright, and that's the bird from the Hello. premonition. <laughs> Come on. Hey, Mike. Boom, shakalaka. Okay. No, you got me. Okay. <laughs> He's got to be feeling pretty pathetic right about now. You can't hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. There was uh, a guidance stone. That was saying not to to let the bird fly away. Oh, that'll play. Right. And then what? Oh, no more. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> yeah, it was in the last totem. <laughs> gotcha. Done. Done. City. So did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. All right, all right. My, my. So are we calling it my favor, then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Ah! Good face. Oh, ho, ho. Okay. Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I gonna get? Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. 
We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Yeah. That is so. I wonder if every time that happens, it builds or breaks relationships between the characters. Oh, back to the... Hello again. Hey. And how are we feeling? I'm doing pretty good. Seems we hardly scratched the surface in our last session, so let's go a little bit deeper this time. All right, cool. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. They women. Not really afraid of planes at all. Not afraid of crowds either. Like I'll go out. I don't like crowds. Not really afraid of heights. It will make you dizzy, but definitely have more of a fear of drowning. Snakes are alright. I'm not a big fan of poisonous, but I hate rodents. I hate rodents. Uh, guns are scarier than. Rodents more than cockroach. And it's not that I'm afraid of. Rats or whatever, I just wouldn't want to hold one. I, for some reason, big ass kind of freak out. I'm afraid of them biting me. Like, I won't hold rabbits or anything. Now, this picture, the clown is scarier than the scarecrow. But in life, clowns do not freak me out. Um, scarecrows, I don't believe do, but if I saw one sitting outside my house somewhere, I'd probably be freaking out or I'd constantly stare at it. Because I think it was something. Um, gore. It, it, no, that that much. But I need crows. But I'm gonna go with crow. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Did that startle you? So yeah, sorry. a little bit. You're doing very well. Go back. You don't want me to concentrate or something? Try to speed up a bit. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. All right. All right. Uh, still rats, more bugs. Crows, more. Getting a shot already. So if some stranger was coming at me, wouldn't. Zombies, scarecrow. Zombies are. Let's go with scarecrows. Get scarecrow. Oh, dogs way more than. Um, lightning storms do not scare me. They actually. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligently. <laughs> uh huh. Can you not do that? Rats, scarecrows, and dogs. Ooh. <laughs> Some combination sounds like a good Friday night. <laughs> but it does for you. Oh, oh, oh. 
Well, I'm afraid. Yeah. Once again, we're uh, out of time. But yeah. Oh, promise. what a shame. We'll talk again very soon. Oh, yeah. Get to end the next chapter.